An electric kettle with negligible heat capacity is rated at 2000 watts. If 2 kg of water is put into it, how long will it take the temperature of the water to rise from 20 degrees C to 100 degrees C? So to solve this question, this is under heat capacity, okay, under heat. So you need to remember this formula, very important formula. The formula is Q is equals to MC theta. And this Q here, it means the energy supplied, okay, or the amount of heat supplied. So since it's energy, you can relate this energy to power. You already know that power is equals to energy over time. So this energy here, which is the same thing as this Q here, this energy and this Q, they are the same thing. So instead of writing Q here, you can just write PT, that is P times T, because energy is equal to power times time. So definitely you can write power times time will give you MC theta. Now what is this M? This M is the mass. This C here is the specific heat capacity. Y theta is the temperature change. So let's go to the question and supply in the values. So this is power here, which is 2000 watts. As you can see here, this is the power, 2000 watts. This is the mass, they're giving us the mass. This is the temperature, 20 degrees C, that is T1. This is the second temperature, T2. So you just subtract them to get the temperature change. And this is the value of C, which is the specific capacity of water. Plugging everything into this formula, you will get 2000 times T is equals to the mass, which is two times Specific capacity, 4,200. Then the temperature change, as you can see. So just subtract 100 minus 20. That will give you 80. So that's the temperature change. So just go there and plug it in here. So this part here is 80 times 80. Then from here, you just simplify it further. So divide both sides by 2,000. So that will give you T is equals to 2 times 4,200 times 80. Divide this by 2,000. So if we cut it out, we get this, cut this. So two year one, two year is four. So you have two times four times 42. So that's T is equals to two times four times 42, which is the same thing as eight times 42. So if we times this out, we get three, three, six seconds. So that's the answer to the question. So check it out in the option. So the answer is, so the answer is option A, three, three, six seconds. If you enjoyed this short video, give it a thumbs up and make sure you follow us for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.